Hello! Welcome back to another Bags and Beauty video. Uh, today I have some spring cleaning suggestions for you. I am really excited about this time to spring clean. Just a side note, this video was filmed during the COVID-19 epidemic, so I have some solutions for homeschooling as well um, as we all find ourselves suddenly homeschooling our children. Um, so there's a suggestion for that coming up. All right, so I'm gonna get started with our largest home organization product, and that is our Your Way Cube. So this one is 12 by 12 by 12. Some of our patterns, like the charcoal featured here, has a chalkboard panel, so you can change with chalk what you store inside. Otherwise, you might find a pattern um, that has a blank section where you can embroider if you know permanently what you are going to store inside. I like this size primarily for DVDs. So I like to make this little pattern here so I can view the titles on the spines of all the different DVDs and Blu-ray. And I have a set of these that I keep um, in an Ikea unit that I use as my TV stand. Um, so it's very useful for that. It's also great for toys and things. Another use that I have for this, a couple ones here that I have in this example, we also do make lids that go, go along with these and they fit on just right if you want to have a lid. My TV stand, I do like to leave it open so I can just tip it out, see the tops of the DVDs and know which one I'm looking for. But if you keep it in a closet, you may like a lid. Another uh, personalization uh, suggestion I have is if you're going to use this for a keepsake box to put a child's name and um, their birth facts, you know, their height and weight and all that good stuff on the box. And you can get them all in charcoal and pick the thread color per child. And then you could fill it with different mementos um, that they save over the years. For example, I've got in here, I've got lots of stuff loaded in here. But for the memento box, for example, their favorite baby blanket and maybe their favorite stuffed animal or doll. I also suggest this for organizing your linen closet. So you can see here that I have some toilet paper um, in there. So I've got that double too high. And then it's also a great um, matchup size for a Clorox wipe container. And then I have rolled towels. So this is great for bathroom organization in your bathroom closet, as well as keeping some keepsake treasures. Now one thing I want to point out to you is that this is 12 by 12, I'm gonna unload it here, make it a little bit lighter. So, this is a great size for whoop, records. So, I have a record sleeve in here, and it fits, oh, it just slid itself right to the bottom. So you can see, 12 by 12 by 12, and it fits records perfectly. It's a record case on the outside, you see how that matches up. Another great use for this is scrapbook paper. It was actually originally designed to make sure that the president of our company, 31, had a great place to store her scrapbook paper. So if you have a piece of scrapbook paper or a record or an old calendar page, you maybe have an old calendar. This is a great way to measure yourself to see if our Your Way Cube will fit on your shelf. Uh, so it's just a great source of measurement to use. Another product that we have is the, the uh, Your Way Display Bin. So I really like this one in bathrooms. Again, we got our toilet paper and our cleaning supplies. This is a great way to keep everything in sight in your bathroom. So I've got a rolled up towel here. This gray item is a rolled up towel. I've got the Clorox wipes and the toilet paper single stack right here. And you can see how nice they are arranged in there. So again, this is a great way to organize your bathroom. It has a taper. You can see how it gets taller in the back and it's shorter in the front. Please excuse this print, it is not currently available on the website, but that's just as a good testament to show you how long these last. 
because I've had this one for two years already and it is in great condition even being used at um, home parties and things. So again, the base of this one is the same size as 12 by 12 piece of scrapbook paper. So you can use your, your record sleeve, scrapbook paper, or an old piece of calendar to measure your shelf to see if this one will fit as well. This one is not as quite as tall. Not quite as tall as the cute. You can see the height difference there. So if your, um, excuse me, if your shelf is not 12 inches high, this one will fit. Let me get, grab a measuring tape real quick. The display bin is about seven and a half inches tall. So if you have a little bit more narrow of a shelf, this will still work for you if it's not a full 12 inches. Okay. So now we also have one more size in our Your Way collection, and that is Your Way Rectangle. So again, this one features the chalkboard panel on one side. Um, on certain prints, on other prints, you can embroider there. This one is a little bit bigger than your standard shoebox. It is um, also comparable in size to a photo box you would find at a craft store. And I want to compare it to a typical piece of printer paper. Just so you can see the size, printer paper is eight and a half by 11, and you can see it is a little bit bigger than that. This baking pan, I know it says on here, 13 by nine by two. And it is a little bit bigger than the baking pan. So if you have a sheet pan for, for sheet cakes, and this fits on your shelf, you just need about another inch and a half of space to be sure that this fits on your pantry shelf. So this is a great place to stick those snacks that the kids can have access to. It's a great place to store photos, and also DVDs fit in this size as well. I really like this one. You can do a single row of DVDs or Blu-rays this way. It's a great way to keep things organized and look less cluttered. I really love this size. Now we have some caddies. This is the Double Duty Caddy. This is one of my favorite products. This one sits on the kitchen in or on the counter in my kitchen. We've got our flashlights ready. I usually keep writing utensils on this side. There's mesh pockets on both sides. So there's four mesh pockets in total and two sections here. So one section has some tablets and the charging cords and the other section has some mail. So what I like about using something smaller like this to organize your mail is that you, you go through it faster. Sorry, I had a little little helper try to come in. Excuse me. Um, so great way to keep your mail organized on your counter um, and reminds you to go through it frequently. Now if you have bigger, like a lot more mail, We've got the Double Duty Deluxe Caddy. So here I have some file folders in here to show you that it fits full size folders. It's got two cargo pockets on the front. Show you those, two cargo pockets. So it has a great place to stick envelopes upright. Um, writing utensils can go all along the side. Scissors, there's mesh pockets here. I'm gonna stick my hand in so you can see. Two mesh pockets on each side. The other side has a Velcro flap here. So this is a great place to keep paperwork organized. You can keep all of your tax information in here. I love the idea of slipping receipts into this Velcro section and then filing it away in the different um, manila folders. So this is a great thing to keep paperwork um, and uh, tax information filed. This is also surprisingly a great gift for new marriages, new homes, and new babies because anything like that where you have to keep files on hand, you, this is a great way to have them all centralized in one place and keep it organized. Even smaller, 
we have our little carry-all caddy, and I like to use this to keep countertops clutter-free. It's a great place to keep your hair products that you use daily, or any lotions and things like that that you keep on your bathroom counter. And it's easy to clean up and take this and stick it in a cabinet when guests are on their way. So the last thing I wanted to show you was this combination here for your school supply central. You combine the display bin with one of our caddies and you have all of your paperwork and your school supplies organized so you can do your homeschooling here during this COVID-19 time. You fit one of these caddies, the, either the deluxe or the double duty caddy, inside the display bin and keep everything in one central place um, so it doesn't clutter up your life. Thank you so much for joining us for another Bags and Beauty video, and I hope you have a wonderful day. This is Sarah Cassins, your 31 gal. Please make sure you like and subscribe to see when I bring out more videos. Bye!